Hey guys, welcome back. Today I am going to show you how to schedule a method using cron expressions in Spring Boot. First, we will see what are the annotations that we are going to use in order to trigger a method and then we will see a small demo on how and where it could be used in our example application. So, we will be using these two annotations called at scheduled and at enable scheduling. Both the annotations belong to Spring Framework, so we do not have to include any other extra dependency in order to use it in our Spring Boot application. The simple rules that we need to follow to annotate a method with a scheduled are a method should have a void return type and a method should not accept any parameters. And at enable scheduling annotation is used to enable the scheduling in our application. So we will be using cron expression to trigger a method at particular time. Crown expression should be set in this format as shown here. Second, minute, hour, day of month, month, and then day of week. And following are the different possible ways how we can set a crown expression. For example, the top of every hour of every day, or every 10 seconds, or 8, 9, and 10 o'clock of every day, and so on. And below is a small example showing how a method is scheduled to be executed at a particular time. As you can see here, the method named trigger reminder emails will get executed at 1645. By default, Spring will use the server's local time zone for the cron expression. But we can use the zone attribute to change this time zone. I'm living in Germany, so I've set the zone as Europe Berlin. So now let's see how to use this uh, scheduled annotation and cron expressions in our example application. So this is our example application where an admin can create a task and assign it to a particular user. For example, there is a task named first task which is due by 12th of January and this task is assigned to Harish Vijaymohan. As per recording date, today is 11th of January so 12th of January is actually tomorrow. Let's say uh, we would like to send a reminder email to Harish saying that he needs to complete this task by 12th of January. Let's see how to trigger this email sending method using our scheduled annotation and cron expressions in our code. So this is our method which triggers our reminder emails to users. As you can see here, this method has a return type void and it does not accept any parameters which makes it eligible for this at scheduled annotation and I have explained all these lines in a previous video on how to send an email using spring, spring email so I'm not going to go through these lines in detail I will just go ahead and annotate this method with at scheduled so this at scheduled annotation is imported from org.springframework.scheduling.annotation.scheduled and it has uh, have given here the cron attribute with 0 seconds, 15 minutes, 16 hours and every month, every day and so on and I have set the zone as Europe, Berlin now the time is 15.50 once I build this application and run it um, hopefully we will get a reminder emails at 16.15 and another important uh, annotation that we have to use in order to enable scheduling is at enable scheduling this has to be on our application class that's it now let me build the application and then run it and let's see if we are getting an uh, email so I have built the application and ran it. Now uh, this is me and I am expecting a reminder email on task named first task which is due by 12th of Jan. Now the time is 16.15. Uh, let's see if we have got an email. Ah, there it is. This is our task reminder saying first task is due by 12th of January. Super, so it works. Um, thank you for watching and see you guys on my next video.